Hey, Diane here. So what is good food? It's so confusing today just to know the definition of what good food is. So my definition for good food is that it's grown with little to no pesticides. It does not hurt people, the planet, or animals. It cares about farmers, farm workers, and food employees. And it's food that nourishes the body and soul, and it tastes delicious. And this, this is my personal definition of good food, it's grown in soil. Um, that raises a lot of issues, that's controversial, but I do believe it should be grown in soil. So does good food have to be organic? In short, no. It's too much to go into here, watch the next episode, we will discuss just organic, but good food does not have to be organic for a lot of reasons. Good food could be better than organic. There's been a lot of co-opting done by large companies. So how do you find good food? I mean, first off, look for food that's at least processed as possible. So you're looking for whole foods, you're looking for the plants. Shopping at farmer's market is an excellent thing to do. And you know, talk to the farmers. Most people at farmer's market standing behind the counter, they're the farmers that grew the food. Ask them about the food, ask them what they think. Um, so the other thing is, you know, if you're gonna buy a house, you're gonna do a lot of research on that house. So just realize this takes a little time. It's okay. Ask friends, watch videos like this, you know, do some Googling, read books. I mean, find out your definition of good food because that's what's important. And let me know, share in the comments below, like what is your definition of good food? What What is missing in the definition I gave? And, and what do you think about food and where food is going? And thank you for joining us in at Food and Farming, episode two.